It's lit now. Shout out M Easy and tune in to the sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Check check check. M Easy, what's up, buddy? Thank you for coming. This is the sit down. Welcome to the sit down, ladies and gentlemen. It's your guy M Easy. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that bell so you get notified every time we post one of these interviews. We do it each and every Saturday. So sit down. I got Mari the Mari Base D One in the building. No, it's Mari based one. Mari based one. Excuse me. Yeah. Wait, uh, it says you're from Seattle. Yeah, we all are from Seattle, Washington. Oh man, that's a far <laughs> flight. Uh, about four and a half, five hour flight. So what's it like in over in uh Seattle? Uh, it's wet. It runs <laughs> yes, a lot. yes, I know that absolutely. When the summertime comes, it's nice. It'd be hot for about two, three months, and it just goes back to rain for like a good majority of the year. The Portland Trailblazers is out there, right? That's Portland, though. That's right underneath us. Oh, that's, see, I, I'm, I'm bad with geography. I'm trying to figure out what's in Seattle besides the Mariners and the fucking Seahawks. <laughs> All right, so so what's going on in Seattle? How, how, how's, how's it for you? What's the rap scene? What's the music scene like out there? Uh, the music scene's cool. There's a lot of upcoming Seattle artists coming up. Uh, as of right now, a lot of people's trying to come together and, like, build as a whole. But, over, but overall, everything's cool. Everything's... I feel like everyone's just doing their own thing, really, too. What differentiates Seattle from the L.A.'s and everything else like that on the West Coast? What different... Well, well what makes Seattle different is... I would say... We're all different. Everyone else has, like, a sound, like a unique sound in each region, right? Mm -hmm. But Seattle has their own sound. And so... What does Seattle sound? Seattle sounds just different. I just, northern the northern flow, really. Pretty so much. then let me get some bars. You want some Can bars? I get some bars while we sit here? My bars? Yes. Let, let, let me hear what Seattle sound like. We in, we in New York. Okay, okay, okay. Let me sound what Seattle sound like on, on the East Coast. Go ahead, talk to me. Okay, I'm going to give y'all something like this. <clears throat> Shake and bake on a mission about some paper to the land of hydro. Baby scrapers, folks deep on the track. Party yacht laid back. Water fights, bottles cracked, all ass and tits. Field seats at the link, turf side the bench, Russell pitched the pack, Super Bowl ring, cellular service, T-Mobile field, Safeco, Ichiro, Griffey, Cano, Sugar Ray from 3, 08 KD, 96 GP, Super Sonics come back, no OKC. Ah, okay, you know, I'm going to stop right there. I'm gonna, I, I, I like sports, I'm an athlete, I'm going to stop right there. Yeah, I didn't, some of y'all ladies that are listening and watching don't understand where he came from. Either Safeco, Link, the Link is where the, Link field. is where who plays there? Seattle Seahawks. The Seahawks play here. You said Safeco. Who plays at Safeco? Well, right now it's not Safeco no more. It's T-Mobile Field. But that, but who who played in Safeco? Oh, Ken Griffey Jr. Ichiro. Felix I'm a Hernandez. Yankees fan. As a kid, Ken Griffey Jr. was my favorite fucking player. I think so. I fuck with Seattle. I love Seattle. Um, what was there was another Seattle OKC, the Seattle I Supersonics. Said, I said no OKC. Yeah, because the Seattle Supersonics moved to Oklahoma. City. Absolutely. But if y'all didn't know that, y'all didn't get that. Okay, so you super, you, you a super Seattle. I fuck with it. I like it. I like it. Okay, go ahead. What else? Uh, it says that you that you, you were a real uh, a fan of Little B the Bass God. Yeah, that's where that's where my name originated from. How? Explain. Well, when I got introduced to Little B, he kind of like took over the internet. You know. Yeah. He was doing all the wild music, and it was different. People thought it was weak and everything, but. The era I'm from, it kind of correlated because I was on the Soldier Boy wave too. Okay, okay. So it kind of just all trickled and trickled. And then just listening to Little B a lot, some of my friends played it a little bit, but I took it kind of more serious. I thought he was just different. I'm big into being different. So one day, I just said, well, I need to make up a name. And this one, I was at a Boys and Girls Club, too, because we went on a trip. Okay. And we, we we went to put our Twitter handles on our shirts, but I didn't have a Twitter. <laughs> okay, okay. Like 2012. Okay. And so I was like, okay, I got to make a Twitter handle. First, it was uh, Mari Base God, but then I was like, no, nah, I can't do that, because that's, like, really stealing the whole yeah, thing. Yeah, 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 a little too much. <laughs> okay, so good. I stopped the God, because I'm not a God, and I put the one. No, 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 no. Okay, see there. Definitely are a God, as a black man. And understand that you are a god. Right. Every every person that that has melanin in them is a god. Mm -hmm. That's that's a god body. That's why I mean I don't know why base god named himself, but as a, as a black man, never never say that you're not a god. You you manifest what you want, who you want, and how you want. You are absolutely a god. But go ahead, as you were. Okay. 
You gotta get woke I, I, a little bit. I like how you said that. I, you know, I never really thought of it that way. It's true. I'm, yeah. I'm I'm a little older. I got a little a little experience, a little seasoning. But go ahead. But I just I just put the one because I feel like I'm the one. So Mari, and that makes perfect sense. So Mari based one, just put it all in one word. What are some of your musical influences besides the bass guy? Some of my musical influences, uh, my dad of course over here, Mr. Benjamin, 2008. Shout out to pops. What's up? Because he's yes, been sir. he's been doing this way before I was born, so I kind of I've been in it my whole life, and. You know, Lil Wayne, I grew up on, I'm a Lil Wayne fan. Which Lil Wayne? The Carter Lil Wayne? I like all of it. I'm off. The, oh, I like okay. all of it, because he's different. He went from being the gangster rapper mm. to switching up to being mainstream pop, really. No, he was, a, he was a mainstream pop artist that was doing gangster rap. Yeah. That, that, yeah, that was Lil Wayne, absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, Mari based one is in the building. This is Sit Down with your guy, M. Easy. Um, how long are you in the city for? Uh, till uh, Wednesday morning. What do you do? Oh, so what are you doing in the, in the city in the meantime? Well, in the meantime, we're doing just a whole bunch of media press around the city, and just really out here networking, just showing my face, is being in the crowd with the people hitting the streets. You know. What is what, what is what, what's the pinnacle we're trying to hit with this rap thing for you? Like, are you trying to be a mogul? Are you just doing this for fun? Like, what what is this rap thing for you for the culture? Just so we know that what what you're trying to do. I'm trying to be the best. I'm trying to be at the top of the top. And I know, it just, I know it takes hard work, and I know it takes dedication, and I'm willing to take every single step of that to get where I want to be. My goal is to get a gold plaque, a gold record. Go, no, that, that, can't be, that can't be the goal. That's, that, we, them, that, that's easy. Gold is easy. Gold is easy, especially in this day and age with the, with the Spotify's and the, two, the YouTubes and all that. You right. need to be, like you said, at the top. Don't right. worry about a gold plaque. But from coming where I'm from... Not a lot of people accomplish that. How many famous people come from the neighborhood you're from? And, and shout your neighborhood out. How many famous people? From your neighborhood. Not 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 Seattle. Not from Seattle. your neighborhood. Uh, neighborhood wise, I can't really think of none on the top of the head. Be the first. Now. Be the first. That's that's real. Be the first. That's real, real. There you go. And I feel like I am going to be the first to keep it 100. Have that confidence, absolutely. Absolutely, I, I like his energy. I'm not gonna lie to you. I think you, I think you've got you've got um, you've got a future out here. Um, let the people know the Instagrams and how to be a part of the wave and how they can listen to your music. Well, you can follow me on all social media at Mari Base One. That's M A R I B A S E D One, all in one word. Twitter, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, and you can stream all my music too. Uh, Apple Music, Google Play, Amazon. Uh, Anywhere you can just download and stream music for free. Even SoundCloud. I'm on SoundCloud as well. And Seattle music is real. I know that. All right, last, last question. What's your favorite TV show? My favorite TV show? Right now. Right now. All right. <laughs> 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 what are you watching on TV? What one thing that what keeps you on the TV? What are you watching? He said Power Rangers. I mean, he ain't lying. I, I mess with it. I, I like Power it. Power Rangers? Don't do I that. Like it, though. Don't do that because listen, a lot of the what, people that are watching my YouTube, like Seattle, they're watching Power Rangers. Power Rangers been on TV for a long time. Talk to me. What? what it, what's wrong with it though? You right. You right. I'm just saying. I like hey. That, listen, if that's what you like, <laughs> that's what you like. I can't, I can't, I can't hate on that. Absolutely. So Power Rangers, your last is your your final answer. We we gonna roll with that, yo. Yeah, ladies, ladies and gentlemen, real. we gonna keep it real. Though. Absolutely, as you should. Hey, listen, nobody knows you better than your pops. <laughs> If he said Power Rangers, he knows it's Power Rangers. Um, let him know how to get a part of the wave, how to find you, how to contact you and all that. Because you're you're in a place now where you need people to be a part of your wave. Let, look at that camera to let them know why they should be a part of your wave out here in Seattle. Y'all should be a part of this wave because, for one, Seattle music is real. We're coming to represent straight from the bottom to the top. And we got a big old wave out in the Northwest. The Northwest is overlooked majority of the time. But you take your time to go out there and look and just embed yourself. There's real deal Seattle music everywhere in the Northwest. Even shout out Portland, all them. Everywhere in that region, real deal music. Thank you for coming. I appreciate you. I Next appreciate time you're on this side, let me know. We'll hang out. Send you to a little party. We'll go hang out with some bitches and all that good stuff. Yep. Appreciate that. Absolutely. <laughs> it's Mari the Bass Scott. Oh, excuse me. Mari Bass One. Mari the Bass One. I was going to say, you go to Bass Scott. Mari the Bass One is in the building. Thank you for coming out. It's a sit down. Studies picks. What's lit now? Shout out M Easy and tune in to the sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Check, check, check. M Easy, what's up, buddy? Thank you for coming. This is the sit down.